Hi kids! Today we will learn what are structures. So let's get started. Structures. Kids, let's see what is a structure. A building is a structure. A table is a structure. A chair is a structure. An egg is a structure. Our body is a structure. Frame of goggles is a structure. So structures are all around us. Structures can be natural or man-made. Egg is a natural structure. Our body is a natural structure. Skeleton, mountains, rivers, trees, beehive are all natural structures. Cars, buildings, furniture, hangers, pens, sharpeners are man-made structures. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects. Here we have many structures. Let's circle the natural structures out of these structures. Egg, natural. Beehive, natural. Taj Mahal, no, it's not a natural structure. It's a man-made structure. Ground nut, natural. Tree, natural. House, no. Hills, yes. Iceberg, yes, a natural structure. Car, no, it's a man-made structure. Fastener, no. Sharpener, no. Mountain, yes, it's a natural structure. River, yes, it's too a natural structure. Spider web, yes, it's too a natural structure. Desk, no, it's a man-made structure. Dam, it's too a man-made structure. So we are done. We have circled all the images which are of a natural structure. Now let's see how structures are useful for us. Functions of structures. Structures hold up or hold together the object. For example, our skeleton is a natural structure that holds up the body. It's the structure of our bones because of which we can stand, walk, and sit. Our skeleton holds up and holds together our body. Our skin is a natural structure. It holds all our internal organs. Our skin is waterproof, that is. It does not let water enter our skin. It is stretchable like rubber. Hanger. A hanger is a structure too. It holds up the clothes straight. Railway track is a structure that helps the train to move on it to cover distance. Roads are structures on which vehicles can move to cover the distance. Bridges are structures that helps to cross over a river or a steep valley. So first, we learned that structures hold up or hold together the objects like skeleton, skin, and hanger. Structures also helps to support a load. Now let's see how. Fishing rod. Fishing rod is a structure that supports load, like it supports the load of a fish and helps to get it out of the water. Chair is a structure that supports our load as we can sit on it. Bridge is a structure that supports load of so many vehicles. Crane is a structure that supports the load of big objects to pick them up and also move them. There is another important function of structure, and that is for looking good 
Some man-made structures are made to look nice. Let's have a look at some famous beautiful structures. CN Tower, Canada. Sydney Opera House, Australia. Taj Mahal, India. Stonehenge, England, Amsbury. The Colosseum, Italy, Rome. Here are some more examples. So kids, let's revise what we learned. We learned that a building, a egg, a body are all structures. Structures can be man-made or natural. We learned that structures holds up or holds together the objects. Examples, our skeleton, our skin, or a hanger. Structures helps to cover or cross a distance like a railway track, roads, bridges, or a ladder. We learned structures gives us shelter, like our houses, dog houses, nests, pen, or a coop. Structures also helps to support a load, like fishing rods is a structure that helps to support the load of a fish. Chair, bridge, crane, all are examples of structures that helps to support a load. Structures are also made of aesthetic value or looking good, like CN Tower Canada, Sydney Opera House Australia. So kids, now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye!